Oh, oh fuck. <laughs> okay. Hey everyone, my name is Mike and welcome back to Alien Isolation. In the last video, we actually went to an alien nest and we found out there's a lot more than just one alien on the ship. Or at the tower, I should say. Um, so, we tried to page the nest and it didn't really work, but it did reset all the power across the whole place we're, that we're in. And um, we got a call from Ricardo saying that communications may have been reset, so we need to go to medical. He's, he's made his way towards comms. So, um... The thing we need to do here is figure out which station takes us to the medical station. <laughs> I can't remember. Uh, uh, that skimmy tower rings a bell. It makes me think it might be there. So, um, the game doesn't, none of these stations say medical on them. So you've got to figure out for yourself. And remember when you, where you've been and where the medical was. So we're going to try this one. We're going to call this. And if we can, we'll hide somewhere. I'll, I'll edit it out, of course, if it's the wrong one. And <laughs> we'll just jump straight to the right one. So let's hope that medical is at this station. Got a feeling it's 50 50. It might be, it might not be. Go go to Sevastopol. Here we go, we made the right, right choice. Here we go. Done it. Memory's not too bad after all. Ricardo, I'm at medical. Did you manage to get to comms? I'm here, but I was too late. Apollo's recovered from the reactor purge and locked out external comms again. Damn it. So why'd you send me here? Plan B, Rip. See, before I left, the system showed a ship approaching Sevastopol. I think it's the Anisadora. Marlow managed to send out his auto codes to call it in while comms were temporarily open. We've got to get to it. Is it docking? No, but it's in a holding position nearby. Head for the ambulance bay. The shuttles are really short range, but they'll make it. Got it. I'm just going to save while we've got a chance to. So the Anisadora has been able to be contacted because all, all the resets, the communications have been opened again. So we're... Oh, shit. Okay, there's movement here. So we're looking for a... What did I say the objective was? Find a short-range ambulance. What does that even mean in space? An ambulance? Okay. So I've seen about f five or six individual aliens. So who knows how many there are and if they're even around this place and I'll... They may still be in the nest by the reactor. I hope they are, but chances are they're not going to be. Right, this we've been up here a few times, and we've always gone to medical there. We haven't actually been through this door, so this is the first time we're entering this new section in um, Skimmed Tower. So I wonder as well if the average Joes have been reset at all, you know, so they're not hostile anymore. Who knows? I really do not know. Just on a little quick search before we push on. But we've quite stocked up on a lot of like weapons and um, gadgets, if you can call them that, you know, items to use as weapons. So um, we're going to go to the primary care floor. Oh shit. So Marlo's out of here. He made it. So that gives us like a bit of hope that there is an escape. It's really doing a number on this place. Alright. We've got movement. Look, it's in the vents. Yeah, there's definitely aliens about. So we we're not completely safe just yet. Oh, the movement's right behind us constantly. There's so many doors to go in here that we're not even using. We're probably going to have to come back and find another tool to access a door, I think. That we're going to have to find. Okay, why not ask me about safety protocols? Is this guy sa Is this guy friendly? Nah, when he causes accidents, yeah, that's one of the things he says when he's chasing you. So, we got a bolt gun. These are pretty, really good. So, we're just going to shoot this guy in the face at one shot. Boom. Oh. oh, fuck. <laughs> okay. That was the shocker. Out of nowhere. 
We need to find somewhere to hide, just in case the alien drops down again. Okay, that was that was silly actually, being spotted right there and all that. We're gonna get under this bed for a second, just to have an idea where they. Eat. All right, so we've got one alien, but how many are there? I don't think this is the initial alien that we used to first encounter. Right, he's, he's, he's on this corridor. He's right there. He's going in there. We're going in that one there. So he hasn't like, gone through properly yet. He could turn around. Right, he's walking away quite a bit. Is he? Where is he? Is this? Does this connect? I don't think this connects. So we're okay to carry on. All right. Okay. 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 I think we've been here before, right? It's, that's his ambulance bay there. So that's, we're heading in the right direction. And the aliens on the other side of that door. It looks like. So I just want to make sure he doesn't spot us. So once we run out of um, fuel as well on the flamethrower, we also do have um, molotovs to use. I've never used them, so I don't know how effective they're going to be against the alien. They're obviously not going to be as good a thing to use quickly. Alright, the alien's... he's coming, he's coming. Okay, now. Those footsteps are loud, right? He's just jumped in the vents, you can hear. He could jump down at any point. I think we've been in that room opposite before. I don't know, I'm just deja vu in a few areas here. Maybe we've never been here. Okay. Okay, what are we looking for? Flashbang upgrade. Let's just get under here a second. Look at the map. Okay, find an ambulance craft in the San Cristobal Medical Facility I I emergency. An ambulance craft. What the hell is an ambulance craft? Does a craft mean like ship? A shuttle? Like ship a spacecraft? Aircraft, you know? But it's ambulance craft, is that what that means? I mean, I could be an idiot right here, what I'm saying, but that's not making much sense to me, an ambulance craft. I don't, want, don't know what we're looking for. Okay, it's not in here, is it? I think the alien's above us in the vents. Right, there's a door we can access here. So we're gonna go open it. Oh. My access tuner isn't powerful enough. Oh, shit. There has to be a way. There has to be, a, yeah, the, find a level 3 upgrade for the access tuner. <sighs> Shit. Is it gonna, it's in this circle, so it's either in this room or just outside that corridor. So it, it's not far. Just gonna hope that there's no vents in here the alien can drop down into. There we go, this is it. Good ship. Alright, let's move. Make sure we got the flamethrower equipped in case the alien wants to say hello. I don't think he comes in here. We've got like a bit of breathing space here. Hack the door and board the shuttle. Is it going to be that easy? Oh, God. Can the alien access the next room? <laughs> oh, God, it's a long code. Um, there we go. Do, 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 do. Can we make it? Ooh, less than a second left on that. That's the longest code we've had. Oh, God. Okay. Coordinates already in the system. Just punch the dash. Punch the dash. <gasps> is, this in a, is this our escape? Sit. No, this is not going to be easy. This is not going to happen. So this is our escape. We're actually doing it. There's a window. It's, it's not on... Did we close the door behind us? Are we heading towards um, Marlowe's ship? I think we are, the Anisadora. <sighs> Alright, so we've landed it looks like. And what happened to the torrents? Did we, 
did that just leave eventually? Or I can't really remember. We couldn't access communications with it. Ricardo, can you hear me? All right, I'm gonna save here. All right, so Ricardo's still back where we left him. Hopefully, he can get across as well. I'll tell you what, though, this, this game is is never ending. You do so much, and it just goes on and on, like forever. Like for the last like ten videos I've done, it feels like we've always been edging to near the end. If in the moments, you know, like. We're about to trap the alien and finish it, then we find more aliens, then we're about to get rid of the aliens, and we don't get rid of the aliens, and it's just, ugh. So, here we are. We've entered a new ship, the Anisadora. This is Marlowe's ship, I believe? I don't know how big it is, if he's actually here or not. Alright, there's a door. So, hope no, there shouldn't really be any aliens on this. Because we should have left them all on the tower. Still gotta check the aim. There shouldn't be any average doors, right? That's, what's this? I think we may have broken our losing streak. We've barely been scraping a living the past couple of years, and the Anissa door is starting to look like the wrecks we salvage. Can't say the crew's been faring any better. Then we found that flight recorder. It belongs to a ship, the Nostromo, Wayland Utani property. That means there'll be a reward. <laughs> But then, Marlowe had an even better idea. Extrapolate the path of the flight recorder to try to find the wreck of the Nostromo. We got lucky. Found a distress signal, and now we're following it. This is it. I can feel it in my bones. He always said he'd do right by me. Uh, that's the, um, the recording before we... You know that bit where we played, where we were on, like... That crash site playing as uh, Marlowe. That's before they went. Right. Oh fuck, it's dark, innit? Oh god. Alright. I think that's automated, right? It's not someone turning the lights on for us, no one's watching us. What's like this? Passcode required, alright. Should be on this table. It's funny, like, the passcode's always on a table and I'm right next to it. That doesn't require any hacking or anything. 4510. Right. Anyway, I had to reset the door key code afterwards. The new one is 4510. Yep. Any anything else useful? No, not really. 4510. All these like big technology like super security systems and they always have the pest code right next door to the doors. So I'm guessing I'm going to restart these generators. I don't really know why we're doing this. You just walk onto a random ship and start starting generators and stuff. Well, I suppose Ian Ripley is an engineer, so she knows what she's doing. What is she doing? No. One second. Explore the Isadora. So we're exploring, but we're actually pressing a load of buttons that we don't really know what they do. But those lights have gone green. And this door is opened. Ricardo, in case you're hearing me, I've got the Inusadora's basic power systems back online. Door should be open. Hopefully some light. Still no sign of Marlowe. Hey, Ripley. Welcome to the Anisadora. Marlo? Where are you, Marlo? Thanks for switching the power back on. You saved me a job. 
I only needed it offline temporarily. I had some things to fix. Fine, Marlo. All right. Maybe you want to join my crew. Plenty of free spots. Taylor? Taylor! Marlo, what are you doing? What no one else is prepared to do. Come find you, Ripley. I got something for you. Fucking alien on the ground there. What the fuck is that about? Why is the baby aliens here? Where's your mother? Where's your mum? Fucking shithead. Oh, that's just a radio. I thought it was a box we could open. <laughs> There is a terminal there. Do we need to access that? I don't think we do. Obviously, if there's a passcode required ahead, we'll step back and look at that, but it doesn't look like there is. Um. Incorrect code? Are you shitting me? Whew. So, Taylor is with uh, Marlo, and she's been double-crossed and all that shit, and... Fucking... Uh, you know... Why is... Uh, why are we not being friendly together? Why can't we not help each other, help each other out and just fuck the aliens up? Why is there always going to be someone who wants to develop the aliens and fuck us all up? Fucking Marlo, you douche. Right, I'm expecting... Gotta build a pipe bomb quickly. Because we pretty much game full on everything. We can craft items maxed and all that. So I'm just trying to make sure we can pick some stuff up. Even if we don't really need it, because who knows what's ahead. Alright, we got a save point right here. Alright, guys, and that's all we got time for for this video. Hopefully, next time we will actually find Marlo in this big ass um, ship, the Nisadora. So thanks for watching, guys. See you next time. Bye!